The imposters from among us aren't SCPs, but if they were, how would the SCP Foundation contain them? A special shout out to Cyan in the Site42 YouTube Super Chat for these priority con procs, and also to TikToker at the top 7 man for assisting in research. As you can imagine, the Foundation is no stranger to shapeshifting entities. The imposters would have a dedicated site for containment due to the possibility of staff duplication. There is debate among high-level staff as to whether the on-site nuclear warheads should be set on the lowest level activation protocol for ease of use in case of containment breach, or the highest due to the nature of the imposters in that their goal is to kill all present humans and the warhead would be a very simple way to do so. They'll solve that someday. Containment cells would be equipped with low-tech pressurized doors similar to those found on submarines. This would prevent the entities from working through the space between the door and its frame, either in case of sabotage or in case they can take other forms. Obviously, their cells would not have vents. Based on their spiked tongues and razor-sharp teeth, the logical leap that they have a different physiology from mankind isn't a stretch. Over time, a reliable, portable scanner would be devised, either technologically or thaumaturgically. Until then, body scans would be necessary for personnel at the end of each shift or when exiting the site. We wouldn't want to have another Dr. Kaufman situation on our hands. Give us more creatures or let us know if there's anything we missed in the comments. Like, share, and subscribe, and become a patron at patreon.com site42.